Hey, good morning, everyone. I am Nadia Jones, and this is the 90-Day Vision Transformation Challenge. Today is Monday, so happy Monday. And it's also week 12 of our 90-Day Vision tra uh, Vision Transformation Challenge. This is the last week. Y'all, this is the last week of our challenge. Um, and... I hope everybody has had a great experience and if you didn't really commit to the challenge but you would like to actually commit and start on day one with me I'm Monday come Monday I'm going to be doing a whole another challenge so I'm, I'm gonna call it round two of the 90 day vision transformation challenge and I'm just gonna continue to do this until I until I just truly become who I'm destined to be and the thing is, y'all, we are always evolving and we will always continue to evolve and grow. Um, so you can participate in this challenge for as long as you want to, for as long as you want to continue to grow. You can continue on with this. This is something, this is a 90 day challenge, but in reality, y'all, it never truly ends because we're always trying to be better we're always trying to do better and it just the more challenges that you do the more that you um attack your your vision the more that you learn how to set goals and actually meet those goals the better of a person that you become the more discipline that you acquire in this journey of your life and you just don't when you acquire discipline you you know how to apply it because it's, it's, it's just something that you continue to use. You don't, a disciplined person does not let their discipline slip. We may get a little relaxed every now and then, but we when we know something works, when we know we need to put on, you know, put on our, our uniform and, and get the job done, we're gonna keep that uniform on. And we're gonna put that uniform on and, and go. Our discipline is our uniform and it keeps us in line with moving towards our vision. So the more discipline that you develop, the better, the stronger, the wiser that you will become. So this is, this is for me, it's been, it's been amazing. I've had a lot of changes happen in my life. Um, I did not get to 90 videos in 90 days. That was a little more difficult than expected, but hey, with this second round, I, I'm, I'm, I'm still going to attempt it. I'm not going to say, um, cause it's, I mean, it's a little taxing to post videos each and every day because I need rest too. Um, but I'm going to, I'm going to post as many videos as I possibly can. And I'm, I'm going to do my best just like I did with this one, but it will be better because I have gotten better. I am stronger. I, I, um, I have developed a routine that works for me that gives me time to work on a few things before I get on on this camera and, and deliver a message to you guys. Um, so I'm, I'm 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 working on a lot of things right now, and I'll be making some announcements in my second challenge. You guys will hear about it, and I'm I'm really excited about it. But um, I can't speak on it yet. But y'all will see. I, I'm, I'm, I'm more than sure that I'll be able to release what I'm working on um, on the second round of this 90 day vision transformation challenge okay but um, again it is week 12 it's time to start up a new affirmation even though this is the last week in our challenge in this challenge start start up a new affirmation again attack those weaknesses that um, your areas of weaknesses make them your strengths okay so if you're suffering, or I mean, if you're struggling in an area, come up with an affirmation that attacks that very struggle. Flip it and make it your 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 strength. Okay. If if you're struggling in in an area, you can attack it with your affirmation, and you can also attack it by setting goals to actually take the time to work on, to develop, to improve, to come up with a plan or so a solution that attacks that weakness as well so i mean and that's this is all part of your ultimate vision right so what if that affirmation needs 
I mean, if that area of weakness not only needs an affirmation, but it needs a solution, like an actual solution for you to apply in your life to improve in that area, make that one of your goals this week. Make that one of your daily goals each and every day this week to attack it, to work on it so that you can you can improve. OK, so that so that um, weakness can no longer be can can no longer be a weakness in your life, but become a strength for you. OK, um, but that's that's for the challenge, y'all. And I thank everybody for um, rocking with me during these 12 weeks. I'm pretty sure I made us repeat two weeks i know one week we did and then i think i accidentally took us back another week but it was all is me trying to balance everything that i'm doing it was it was fun but on the next challenge that won't happen i'm i've improved i'm i'm, I'm going to be better on the next challenge so that won't happen again um but i'm excited y'all and i hope y'all are excited too especially those that you know came in in the middle of the challenge and you weren't quite sure of where to start and where to um, begin listen, Monday next week I'm starting this challenge all over again All right, I'm going to continue to pick up where I left off all of you that's been on here continue to pick up where you left off and all of you that want to make that change in, in your life this is where you'll make the, that change your chance to start creating the life that you desire begins next Monday. You got the, all of this week. You have all of this week to prepare. Write your ultimate vision um, <clears throat> and come up with your first affirmation that you'll do for the um, first two weeks of the of the challenge. That is your whole. That's your homework assignment if you're going to be joining this challenge with me on uh, next Monday. Uh, write your ultimate vision, where you see yourself in life. Think about the person that you desire to be. Think about the, the, the career or think about the, the work, your purpose in life that you actually desire to be doing, that God has shown you. Take it to God. If, if, you, if you don't know what your vision is, take it to God. Ask God to reveal to you what your vision in this world is i mean in this in this what your vision what his purpose for you in this life is ask him to to reveal that to you and <clears throat> and come up write it out think it see it feel it and and envision yourself being who god called you to be created you to be doing what he called you to do okay so that's your homework assignment. For those of you that will be starting this, this challenge for the first time. Because you missed the, the first go around. You got. It's, I'm starting a whole new challenge on Monday. So get your ultimate vision together. And your first affirmation. That you'll be doing for the for the first two weeks. Alright. And I'll be going down this, this whole challenge again. Breaking it down for you all. Day by day. And also giving you. A message of encouragement um, throughout this challenge. I'm gonna try to do encouragement, motivation, inspiration, do something like that in each video that I put out, along with instruction. All right. Um, but again, y'all, I'm excited. I thank you all for uh, rocking with me, and you know, getting to know me a little bit on this challenge. Um, I probably will be opening up a lot more in the second go around. The more I get comfortable, the more, um, you know, I get feedback from from you guys, the better things we'll, we'll get. I mean, because things cannot go backwards. We can only move forward. I'm not backtracking. I am only working hard to improve to be the best version of myself and i'm pushing you all to be the best version of yourselves okay that's what this challenge is all about all right so it's monday it's time to attack the week our last vision i mean our last week in this challenge and let's let's finish strong y'all and i encourage everyone i encourage everyone to join me on this second go around 
because it's, it's gonna be good it's, I mean like I said we can only get better when you're working on yourself there's nothing that you can do to make you backtrack when you're constantly working to improve you as a person this I mean the smallest of changes that that make you better the, the smallest of changes that make you more timely that um allow you to save more money that um allow you to have more time for yourself in the morning to get a routine it's, it's really when you're doing things to make yourself better you can't you can't go wrong you just cannot yes things may get tougher in life because there are forces out there that see you transforming see you waking up to who you truly are who god created you to be on the inside of you and and you're bringing that into reality and you're walking you're learning to walk in that authority so yes there's going to be forces that come against you but remember we have already overcome because greater is he that is in you than he that is in this world and there's no way there's no way that we can lose because god has already done it for us y'all we have already won all right it's your time to win it's your time to walk in your victory. Let's do this together. All right. That's all I have for y'all today. I love y'all. Keep grinding.